Hey guys, Ultra Maximus official merchandise is now available on my Spring Store. Help support the channel and shop by clicking the link below. Oh, hey, it's Great Value Luke Skywalker. Hey guys, Ultra Maximus back with another toy review, and today we're going to take a look at a figure from Star Wars Visions. It's Car Care Kari from the episode The Twins on uh, Disney+. Plus. Now, this was actually an anthology I really liked, so I was super interested to take a look at these guys. So let's go ahead and take a look at the packaging. So here we have Car Care in the packaging. We got the Visions logo, Bandai, get the figure there. We get it in Japanese at the top, which looks cool. We get an image with his sister on the side. Uh, we get him on the side there, so just kind of a close up. He's got very cotton candy looking hair, but yeah, it's from the first Star Wars Visions series. Definitely cool. Dark side and light side twins. So again, Car is the light side twin i like the japanese right here i think that looks really really cool and uh yeah uh the nice thing about this i really like we get the light side star destroyer there and if you put his sister am on the side there we go we get both of them linked up like we saw on the show that's super slick that's really about it for the packaging let's get this guy out of box and see what we think so here we have Car outside of the packaging, and this is actually a really well done looking figure. I was very, very impressed with it. Very anime. Um, unfortunately, it has no articulation. It's basically a little plastic statue, uh, but I was kind of expecting that, to be honest. Um, he does come with his lightsaber and a base, so that's pretty cool. Now, the cool thing is the base pops right off, and you can actually just stand him up by himself so like so yeah it's got a couple little peg holes in there definitely recommend using the base for stability for display though um, and he's got this lightsaber which is cool um, i like the purple to blue it's very thin though um yeah definitely pretty cool looking there's no articulation like i said on this figure but it's definitely cool It'd been nice to have some minimal articulation for some posing that would have been kind of cool like the chain we got the little little pack back here he kind of has this anime han solo vibe going on with his outfit which is kind of funny now uh, i will say that this lightsaber right here there's a flat piece that goes forward and then you can get it in there uh, be careful when you put it in because it's so terribly thin and brittle you don't want to break it so let's go ahead and plop him back onto his base here and yeah there he is, and that's about it for the figure. Taking a look at the figure himself, again, looks just like he did in the show, so I definitely dig that. He's got this cotton candy vibe, all the blue on his little blonde anime here. I like the jacket, again, very Han Solo-like to me, and he's got these blue streaks going down his uh, white undershirt. I definitely like that, and it's very... Uh, asymmetrical very uh, very very different on either side so all in all i think they did a good job with the sculpt you know he looks like he did in the show very anime which was the point now taking a look at the midsection of the figure again i like the blue stripe down his shirt uh, we get some blue on his vest i like the silver chain the pack he's got hanging off the back there and then of course the lightsaber very very cool i like how it starts off like this purpley color and it goes down to the light blue the handle looks nice with the red and the silver and the black paint apps on it all in all very cool and uh, just really well done he's got a very striking pose but a little bit of articulation at least would have been nice to kind of you know mix the pose up a little on this figure and finally, taking a look at the legs of the figure. Again, he's got his boots, 
the blue stripes very cool again very han solo looking uh, we get the tip of the lightsaber with that translucent blue that looks really cool and i do like the fact he comes with a base this figure stands well enough alone that he doesn't need the base but it's nice to give it that extra support especially with this statue-esque kind of figure that you're going to want to put up on display and that super fragile lightsaber you definitely want to use this for comparison here we have Carr from Star Wars Visions next to the Marvel Legends Retro Dark Phoenix uh, figure from X-Men. And yeah, he's definitely taller than she is. It's probably in a 7-inch scale where she's in the 6-inch scale. And, well, I mean, she's got articulation. She's actually an action figure, whereas this guy is basically a small vinyl statue, which is not bad, but I was kind of hoping for an action figure. So is Carr from Star Wars Visions segment, The Twins, something that you want in your Star Wars collection? Well, if you are a Star Wars completist, you might want to get it. If you really liked the Star Wars Visions series, this is definitely something that you might want to pick up. Now, originally, this was a $30 figure. Totally not worth $30 at all. I picked mine up uh, at $15 at Ross, which was a bit much, but I did find them at another Ross for $10. So if you can get this guy for $10, maybe $15, it's not a bad figure to pick up if you're into the anime and you're into the Visions series. Uh, I, the only reason I bought it, because that was one of the two animes I really dug out of that series. Uh, the other being the kind of um samurai one with uh the sith and the little wooden droid it was almost kind of fun i liked that one a lot but uh yeah this one was interesting as well and it was cool to see this in plastic form so there he is car or care how do you pronounce it leave a comment down below from star wars visions by bandai hey guys I want to give a shout out to my top subscribers and to my newest subscribers. Thank you all so much for helping grow the channel. Remember, for every 1,000 subscribers, I'll give you, the fans, a chance to win a free action figure. If you don't see your name and want to be included, like this video, add a comment down below telling me to add you, and of course, subscribe. Thanks again, and look for more videos in the future. Hey guys, thanks for watching. To watch more Ultra Maximus, click on the links to the right. Be sure to click all the things, subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell for new videos. And follow me on all the social medias, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Links in the description below.